You the one that gotta make that change. You understand? You gotta change. Uh, nobody up here can change for you. You gotta change. And guess what? We out here killing ourselves. We out here killing each other. You understand? So guess what? We we gotta change our mind. We got it. Our heart is our mind, according to the Bible. unto thee. <laughs> Thou shalt shall like, see it no is, more again. What's going on, bro? How you doing, man? All what's right. your name? Michael. Michael? All right. Yeah, no. <laughs> all right, all right. Hey, you recognize yourself on the sign right here? Hold on, Sean. You recognize yourself right there on the sign? No, Sean. We got so-called African American. Yeah, so-called American. Yeah. And there, American. there. He shall be sown. So that's what we are here to do. We are here to wake our people up and let them know who they are. So right now we're, we're going over the curses, trying to see if your spirit bears witness with these curses that we're bringing out. If so, you, would you say your name was again? Michael. Michael you are an Israelite. Of course. If I had a choice of where I want to be, you can see me running to the battleground. Front line, first infantry. I want to be the first one there to get down. I would die on a daily. I'm coming up to sacrifice me right now. Put me in the army of the most high. Put me in the army of the most high. Milk dripping from my cheek, but I put down the rattle for thou was girding me with strength for the battle guy. Understand? Read from the beginning. Yeah, read from the beginning. It's the book of Deuteronomy, chapter 28, verse 68. Hold on, sir. I'm going to give this five minutes. Give five minutes. Hold on, sir. And the Lord shall bring thee into Egypt again. So this is Moses talking to the Israelites. He okay. said the Lord was going to bring you into Egypt again. Egypt is synonymous for what? Uh, Slavery, you understand? So Egypt is synonymous with slavery. So what I asked Sherman was, what way of transportation did the Most High God bring us over here? Our forefathers. How did our forefathers get over here on this side of the uh, world? Oh. On boats, right? Sherman, yes, sir. how did we get over here? Boat. On boats, right? Yes, so what we're going to find out, this is our history book right here that we're reading. This only happened to one nation of people. Only one nation of people went into slavery by the way of ships, right? Am I correct? Yes, All right, read it. And the Lord shall bring thee into Egypt again with ships. So the Most High God said he was going to bring us into slavery again with ships. Mm -hmm. He's going to bring us into slavery again with ships. Read. By the way whereof I spake unto thee. Thou shalt see it no more again. So Moses is telling the Israelites, just like I'm speaking to you, you're not going to see your homeland no more again. As a, as a nation of people, we're not going to see our homeland again. What's our homeland, uh, Sherman? Uh, Egypt. What do we read? What, what's our homeland? Begins with J. Jerusalem. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. Jerusalem is our homeland. We, as a nation of people, we weren't going to see our homeland no more again, right? Right, right, right. Follow right, right. me? Yeah, oh, yeah. Read. And there ye shall be sold unto your enemies. Unto your friends. Enemies. Unto your friends. Enemies. Because guess what? The Most High God said when we got off those slave ships, we was going to be sold to our enemies. Because guess what? A lot of us think that we're friends, but the, uh, who, who, matter of fact, who sold us? Who Bring it sold out. us once we got off those slave ships? Bring it Jeez. out. Once we got off those slave ships, who sold us? Some of your own African kings sold us. Okay. That was, that, that, was that was an African. That was an African. I'm talking about, like, no, no. That's what Harkin, Harkin and Lester. He said, yeah, once, we, once we got the European, yeah, yeah, yeah. you agree with that? Yeah, I was, so, I, I was talking about it. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, he's right. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 So, yeah. so, yeah. so yeah. Yeah. So look, once we got off those slave ships, it said we would be sold to our enemies. Because guess what? Our enemies wouldn't hang us from trees. Right. Our enemies wouldn't cut open pregnant women's stomachs and, and use the babies for alligator bait. You understand? I mean, y'all brothers. Our brothers wouldn't do it. But our enemies, God said our enemies would, right? right. So our enemies is one. 
But who did God say our enemies were? The so-called white man. Yeah, the European so-called white man. They sold us into slavery. Yeah. 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 And sir, you shall be sold into slavery. Yeah. 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 For bond men, for slave men, and bond women, and slave women, and no man shall buy you, and no buy, no buy you, no meaning nobody will be able to save us, because we had a, a, a lot of black leaders Dance. that tried to uh, <laughs> that tried to save us, right? All money, right? We, yeah, we, look, we had Malcolm X, we had Martin Luther King, you know what I'm saying? We had a whole lot, Harriet Tubman, you know what I'm saying? A lot of Martin Luther King, we had a whole lot of black leaders that tried to yep. save us. with joyfulness and gladness of heart, we didn't want to keep the commandments. Our forefathers and four, four mothers didn't want to keep the commandments, right? Right. Read. Therefore shall thou serve thine enemy. He said, because y'all didn't want to keep the commandments, y'all gonna serve our enemy. Y'all gonna serve your enemies now, right? With what? Which the Lord shall send against thee. In hunger. At least so the most high God, God brought God. our enemies against us. He said, in hunger. Mike, where, where do you go and get your food from? Change. Where I go get my food from? Yeah. Uh, all over fast food. Because of work. <laughs> okay, what grocery stores did you get your food from? Oh, okay. Kroger. Yeah. Okay. Who, 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 who owns Kroger? Teach. We don't own nothing. Right? Yeah, we, we don't, don't own nothing, right? We don't own but the no most I got said. Most of, right. <laughs> Most of God said, look, no, be, hey, because we didn't want to keep the commandments, yeah. he said, guess what? You're going to serve your enemy in yeah. hunger. Now you got to go to Kroger's. You got to go to your um, yeah. your enemy and, and buy groceries. Yeah. Yeah. You understand? Yeah. Read. And in thirst. And in thirst. You want water. Aquafina. Uh, Dasani. You know what I'm saying? You got to pay your water bill, don't you? Pay your water bill. Yeah, your water bill. Hey, if you don't pay your water bill, what happens? <laughs> they cut you off, right? They God you said, down. because you didn't want to keep my commandments, you're going to serve your enemies in hunger and thirst and what else? And in nakedness. And in nakedness. He's talking about the clothes that you got on. All that cotton that our people picked in slavery, guess what? We don't own no fabric. It's a made in China. You see yeah, that? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, we don't own nothing. Yeah. Read what you got. And in want of all things. In want of all oh, things. Hey, are you married? Yeah, this right you married Mike? Yeah. So you had to get a what? A marriage license? Yeah. You, had yeah. you, had license. you had to get a license right. from your enemies. You know what I'm saying? You you get uh, you went to college or anything? Yeah. You went to college? So you had to get an education from your enemies. You know what I'm saying? Anything. You know what I'm saying? You got to have to go to your enemies to get it. It won't all like, like worth like a billion dollars, right? Huh? My first one like worth a billion dollars, right? Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. I gotta go. Okay. Hey, so um check us out. Uh one thing, um uh, Oh yeah, yeah. First, oh yeah. And he shall put a yoke of iron upon thy neck until he have destroyed thee. Who did that happen to? It'd be like you. Right, right. That's what, this is what we're reading right here in the Bible. He said he was going to put a yoke upon upon our necks until we've been destroyed. Destroyed as a people. Guess what? Hey, he said until, read it again. Until he have destroyed thee. So what is he talking about when he said until we have been destroyed? So is he talking about we all died off? No. He's not talking about that. No. Destroyed mentally. Right. You know what I'm saying? Just like a, a dog, when you put a leash on a dog, at first it's running around and stuff, you yank it. Yeah. Then after a while, it starts getting trained. Right. It starts right, programming. Right, right. You know what I'm saying? He's yeah, conditioned now. Program. You know what I'm saying? So now you can take the chain off and it's going to walk right beside you, right? right? And that's what happened to us now. Now, we don't celebrate the Most High God's High Holy Days. We celebrate Christmas. Right. We celebrate Thanksgiving. Right. We celebrate Easter. Right. You know what I'm saying? That we celebrate our birthdays crazy. and stuff like that. <laughs> right. All these, you ever yeah, wonder, why, why are these holidays that we celebrate, I'm not in the Bible? 
Chris, you celebrate Christmas? Yeah. So, did you know celebrating Christmas is against God's law? It's against God. God never told us to celebrate Christmas. Bring it out. It's in the Bible. We used to scream black power while Heron was pushed. But at the end of the day, nothing's in vain. IUIC has been given a vision. The tents of Judah has risen. Many has attempted the mission. Minor murmuring, omitting, and missing the mark. Just reading that he had the flame of fire in his eyes gave us the spark. We on Paul's mission. We out on the road, purple and gold, from Mexico, Cuba, Haiti, Ghana, Sierra Leone, 144,000 boots banging, concrete crackling. These are how our men repented at heart. The scriptures is proof. IUIC, we deliver the truth.